Hello guys, in this video we are going to discuss about Spark 4x new features. We will see all the features one by one in this playlist. Let's start one of the best features is called JSON Variant Data Type Inference. That's we are seeing some examples now. Let me going to add the functions. So PySpark SQL, I am going to add the Spark session as well as the functions with the Spark JSON, 2JSON and Pry Variant. These three functions will help to infer the data from Variant Data Type. So let's see some example. First, I'm going to infer the spark variable, and here I'm going to use a remote. So before we are using master, now we are going with a remote right now. So in this remote, we can connect via Spark Client API. Later session we will discuss that in detail. Now I'm going to create one variable. So in this variable, the column name is called JSON string, and it has three values A, B, C, and the values 10, 20, 30. This is just completely JSON string. Let's see some example output. You can see JSON string as a string data type, it just return and I can see the value A as 10, B as 20, C as 30. But this is string JSON data, we cannot extract directly from here. So to avoid this, we can use the JSON variant. So that's we can use with the post JSON. So here df select post JSON function that I am trying to infer from there and df JSON string. So this is the column name that I am trying to infer it and create as a JSON var as a new column name I just derived it. Let's see the output. So previously the data comes with a string data type, now it just provides a variant data type. So based on this variant data type, we can infer the data very faster. So let's see how we can extract the data A as a key value from this JSON variant. So this is the conditions, I can use it. Try variant, I can use in the select transformation. JSON variable is a variable name and root dot A. So dollar means is a root, root dot, first key I am trying to extract, A is a key I am trying to extract and this is the written output as an integer data type I am trying to extract from that. Let's see the output for clear understanding. So now we can extract the data as expected. So this is the way we can extract the data from variant data type. In future it will be very helpful for everyone, those who are all working with the JSON data. And JSON variant data type is 8x faster to compare with normal JSON string data type. So in future Spark 4x version, it will be very much helpful for everyone. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please provide your valuable feedbacks and comments.